How's it going guys? This is Matthew over at ASPE. Today we're going to talk to you about getting dots on your gloves. So what we got here is the LP2XL. This is our larger format machine, uh, usually made uh, to print a 10 by 10 area for bags, uh, clothing, whatever you need. So you guys can see what goes on with the uh, rapid tag, I'm gonna go ahead and push start. So first things first, you have the glove on the machine, you have a product sensor. This product sensor is gonna tell it to print. If there's nothing past the product sensor, as you can tell, nothing will print. Flash gears, you see that nice light going on? Once that light turns on, that's the heating mechanism that will dry the ink. Once it goes onto the unloaded, it will grab it, throw it right off. So this machine is typically used in a high-end production setting. When you have thousands, maybe even millions of gloves per month going out, this is something you want to work for. So in order for this machine to realize that there's a product on it, it needs to have a product sensor. So this product sensor is positioned perfectly for gloves. Once it goes by, you can see that the print will then be done. Alright guys, so this is the uh, print head for the LP2XL. I just want to kind of talk about it for a little bit. Uh, the first thing you see, um, the squeegee head going back and forth, right? This is customizable to go faster or slower. Okay, we have here uh, squeegee pressure. So adjusting this bad boy right there, you're able to put more pressure or less pressure. Uh, when it comes to dots, we have a very thin piece of aluminum with uh, CNC drilled holes. Now the point of this is to get the ink within the walls of these, uh, of these holes and have that squeegee pass over nice and smooth, uh, creating a, a, a pressured effect that will push the ink onto the glove. Once the glove, uh, once the screen is lifted up, uh, away from the glove, you will uh, get a suction uh, pulling the ink out of these pools. Okay, and then the trick to getting these dots nice and, and perfect is the viscosity of the ink. It needs to be able to flow through the hole without getting stuck. Okay, so let's move on to the flash gear. All right, guys, this is the flash gear. Uh, what we use is high density quartz lights. Um, the, uh, the purpose of this is to basically double the heat ratio of a normal conveyor dryer uh, with nearly eliminating uh, the time factor all in all. So once it's printed, it comes right under this bad boy. Uh, with dots, typically it takes anywhere from uh, uh, two to about five seconds under this lamp. And that will give you a nice cure to that glove. And of course, we have a second one here for insurance purposes. So right after you get that first cure done, it goes under the second head, and that's when you got that nice finished product ready to go. All right guys, the last step in high-end production using the ASP Rapid Tag Machine for dotted gloves is the unloader. So the purpose of the unloader is to come in and pull off the product being finished, tossing it into a box. So if you're doing a full set of large gloves, you have a box here made specifically for large, it would then pull off the glove and dump it into a box having a finished product, as you can see here. The screen we use to print these dots. So this is a 1 16th uh, piece of aluminum. As you can see, the holes are CNC'd out. Very thin screen. Doesn't bend much. Uh, we see that this is uh, the best method uh, compared to the traditional method of using a mesh or uh, capillary film. Uh, I believe that this is a, a better method because it, it takes only a one pass in order to get those dots on the glove uh, rather than multiple passes. And that saves time. And what is time? Money.